What's going on, dickweeds? Breakfast. Got some toast, some eggs, hash brown, a blueberry waffle, some fried bologna, uh, apple juice. Donna's got the same thing over here except she's drinking coffee. There's Donna. Hello. Do you got a joint, Donna? No, I don't. Not smoking one right now? No. Are you sure, Donna? Yeah. Why, Donna? Uh, I don't have time for a joint right now. <laughs> There's always time for a joint. Not in my life. <laughs> Fuck! Hey, eh? I hate to be you. <laughs> okay, I got some nine-pound hammer loaded up right there. Got some more nine-pound hammer right there, ready to go. Hey, eh? uh, yeah. I'm gonna stick you cocksuckers on the counter. It's Friday morning. We decided that we're gonna have breakfast and talk with you guys because uh donna's got the prick coming here later hey donna yeah the prick yeah we get a new mattress yep we we bang so much on the other mattress that donna <laughs> bought that the thread started to come out and they're coming to replace it for us today it's supposed to be able to handle a good banging <laughs> Okay, I just need to get some paper towels. You got paper towels? Do you need more paper towels? No. Do you need anything else before I sit down, Donna? No. Are you sure, Donna? Mm-hmm. Okay, Donna. I've never seen that before, Donna. Dipping it in like that? Not like that. <laughs> no, is there a special way to dip? I don't know, but that looks pretty sickly. It's sickening. You get it all. You get it all. Wah. Bleh. Hey. Okay. I gotta get in a breakfast toke. I wanna be able to taste these flavors. Hey. You guys might be wondering, where's the maple syrup? We don't want any. I, I'm not a big fan of maple syrup, and Donna. We only have Aunt Jemima right now, and Donna's not a big fan of Aunt Jemima, so. No. I like the real stuff, and if I can't get the real stuff, I'll go with like a buttermilk. And I don't, I don't like syrup. It's real rare that I eat syrup, so it reminds me of the smell of piss. Syrup's tree piss. It is. It's tree piss. It's good. I don't like the smell. <laughs> better, eh? Fucking right. The weather is shitty. It keeps raining still off and on. It's just, it's just shitty weather. Shitty weather around here. The Timmins weather's fucked. You wake up and everything's gray. Yeah. Hey, we gotta move. Uh, last night there's a there's a great big fucking bear in the neighborhood. Uh, what was he like? Fucking four hundred pounds. At least that I was outside smoking at a joint. Actually, me and Charlie were outside, and Ed was in here. 
taking a little nap. I was laying on the couch, <laughs> yep. And I heard like bang, and I'm like, fuck, who is fucking banging their car door? I was thinking like at this time of night, so I looked over and there was a great big, huge bear over there. He was manhandling that garbage can like it was nobody's business. <laughs> <laughs> So I ran in to get Ed to let him know. And he came and got me. We watched that big bastard. He. I get. I grabbed my camera to record for you guys, but I don't got no light on my camera. In the dark, everything's fucking blurry and fucked. So. He yeah. didn't come in. So. We checked the security camera, and we have a little bit of the bear. If you can find it, I'll show it to them. Oh, Just get it ready at the at the right part. Um, I'll be right back. You know what I forgot? No. My uh, your uh, what do you call it? Your glass tray. Oh. I need to borrow your glass tray so I don't have to keep getting up. I brought my I brought my weeds to the breakfast table. Eh? Okay? Fucking right. He's somewhere because I seen him on the camera last night. Uh, maybe it's this one. Oh, it's, Did you this, find him? it's this one here. Okay, hang on. Uh, okay. So I'll zoom it in a bit, and you just have to hit play because he's he's right over there. That you'll okay. I'm coming to show you guys. Maybe it's a she. I don't know. I just say it's a he. Hey, that oh fuck, I moved it. That black dot right there is the bear. I'm gonna hit play and where the fuck's the play button? That's like a 400 pounder over there. Look at him. He's heading to the garbage. I think you can actually hear on there. Well, anyway, he's behind the car. Well, I started talking. You heard him take it down, maybe. I don't know if you heard it or not, but yeah. He's behind the car now and he. He tears apart the garbage and runs off to the other side, lays down on the on the grass, eats it, gets back up. <laughs> Comes back for more. And then, um, so I guess that big one, right? Because it mm -hmm. ran up into the apartment buildings. And then after I, I posted a thing on the bear activity because, you know, what if somebody's fucking walking then I wouldn't want to run into a bear that size, any bear actually. So the bear actually went, cut through the apartment buildings and went across on the next street and went to their backyard where he eats some apples. Where are, where's the apples? Um, if you, at the corner over here, <laughs> like here's the road and then here's the road. Okay, so it's that way? Yeah, it's like on the, <laughs> you know where McLean's? First the bear ripped apart the dude's garbage on Bruso he really across like, the street. I didn't know they could drag or do that with garbage cans. Yeah. I have no idea they... Then he went over... Here. To the one that you guys just seen. He crossed the street and went to the next garbage. And then he went between the apartment buildings and then he crossed over onto another street and went to somebody else's backyard to have blue... Or not blueberries. Um, you went to score some free apples. Yeah, but I guess the apple tree is just about like... The bears ate just about all the apples <clears throat> off He's the tree. He's a big fucking bear. I don't know if I don't know if you guys can see how big he was in the video there, but he's seeing him in real life. He's big. And and the way he runs, like if he was running after you, consider <laughs> yourself dead because you're not. Even when there was cars going by, right? Like the other bear, he would run all the way up the tree. The one from uh, last time. Mm -hmm. This bear, if a if a car slowed down because they noticed him, he would just hold on to the the what is it the trunk. Yep. He wouldn't even go all the way up and then he would just come back down. <laughs> oh yeah, I got some notes here. Did I say it was Friday? I oh. think so. Okay, well yeah, it's Friday morning. 
I wrote down the bear because I wanted to show you guys the bear. Hopefully you were able to see it. I tried to film it with my... I got I to gotta invest in a, a light for at night time because everything's blurry that's out in the darkness, you know? Everything just turns into a black blur and... Yeah. You said the brick was coming today? They told me, yeah, they called me yesterday and they said you'll call half an hour before they come. Well, that's not a lot of time when you have to move a mattress and bring it down here because God forbid they come in the house and do anything. They just kind of leave it outside. Here you go. <laughs> um, and that's all I have except for one other thing. I seen this weird thing this morning. Let me clean out my bowl here. Um, I was looking out the window and there's a, there's a nut house across the street, the Nitwit home, and there is like a nurse lady, I, I guess she's a nurse, I don't, I don't know if she's a nurse or not, but she goes there and she watches over the Nitwits. Well, this morning one of the Nitwits was outside with his, with his headphones on, and he was like fucking... He's just dancing, you know, at his fucking doorstep because they're they're fucked over there, and I don't know what's up with that. There's there's two of them that they they really boogie at the door. I don't know what the fuck kind of drugs they're on, but anyway, uh, so she got she she walked across the lawn this morning with a white gun type thing that you'd scan things in the grocery store with, and she went up to the guy and she she scanned his forehead. And I told Donna about it, and Donna said she knew what it was, and I'll, I didn't... I'll let Donna tell you what she told me, because I just thought it was fucking weird that somebody was getting their forehead scanned. It seemed fucked. Okay, so when, he, when Ed told me about this, I heard about this, I'm pretty sure they were doing it in the States. Maybe I'm wrong, but maybe it's somewhere else. But If you're from America and you know about this, let us know. It, I don't know if it was getting into certain workplaces or what it was, but anyways, they said that they had this thing and they were to scan to see if you had a fever. If you had a fever, you couldn't go into the store. I didn't know they had them here in Timmins, so I said, well, she would have scanned... It's like this, I don't know, they scan and it's like, a, and it reads your fucking temperature. I don't know how because in the hospitals here, they always have to stick that fucking thing in your ear. Well, now you could just scan somebody's head for... Seems strange to me. It, that's the part I don't like. So if you had a... It looked food, weird. She, she scanned him like he was produce in the supermarket. Burp. I don't know if there was a beep sound. I was inside. I was looking I out the window. I don't know if there's a beeping sound or know. not. But I seen her put it to his forehead, and he just continued to dance because I don't know what he's on. Like he doesn't. Even, I don't even think he knows what the fuck's going on. But yeah, you know, she scanned his forehead, and then she just continued to go into the house, and he continued to stand there, fucking dancing to the music, you know, and just yeah. There's two of them out there, two native they, dudes, they really Indians, get them they do like two Canadian Indian guys, uh -huh. and yeah, they just dance. they really. They're really going up there. Yeah, they do some of this. Yeah. Sometimes they just go like this. Yeah, sometimes they stop and there's some hysterical laughter. And then they <laughs> keep on bobbing. Bop, bop, bop. And sometimes they even point and laugh at stuff that's not even there. Yeah, I don't... <laughs> it's a little bit weird. Of it. But I'm. my concern is, what if... Because if they're saying if you have a fever, you say if that guy had a fever, well, then they would say, oh, he has COVID. But just because you have a fever doesn't mean you have fucking COVID. That's, that, whoever's believing this has got to be fucking stupid. They're leading up to the mark of the beast, probably. Well, they can piss Maybe. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. But, but I, maybe. Would, eh? you, would you allow it to happen? If Say if we went to Independent and they said, okay, before you go in, we've got to scan you to see if you have a fever. scan my cock. I don't want that shit on my forehead. I don't want it either. I, I would say, oh, well, I guess I'll find somebody else to pick up the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I just don't. And they're still, they're like, now that the kids are going back in school, right? Soon? That's all you hear about. Second wave. Second wave. That's all I'm fucking re Get ready for the second wave. Second wave's coming. Stock up on food and ass wipe. 
and paper towel and cleaner. Mm -hmm. They're just and yeast and, and flour. Ye yeah, those kind of things. Cause I don't know what's gonna happen. The first time, the grocery stores cannot fucking say that they're ready to deal with this because before all this, when they were stocked and so much, right, it went like boom, like. It just came, an announcement came across, right? And it was like everybody went and fucking stole everything off the, well, they didn't steal, but they bought it all up. And it's announcement like, came, and then all of a sudden, fuck! Yeah, hey! Yeah, everything was, was gone. Everything. Cock yeah. suckers. They leave nothing behind. I remember how hard it was to get toilet paper and oh stuff. Oh my god, it was like I was placing fucking orders, like I placed an order at Home Depot, and by the time Even I the there, meat went missing for a while. Yeah. Not for a long time, but for a few days there was some freezers of meat that were just totally gone. Mm -hmm. I forget what kind of meat. It was it all was, the good stuff. The chick it was all the meat. It was chicken, hamburger and pork. It was I remember walking to the grocery store and it was fucking bare. Yeah. Ugh. I hope that doesn't happen again, but it's probably gonna. So oh yeah, turkeys are on sale right now. Mm hmm Food basics. They're the utility ones, but who gives a crap? Who gives a fuck? With the second wave coming, throw them in your freezer. It's good to have turkey. They're 99 cents a pound. That's a good deal. Even if you got a couple small ones, who cares? At least you're going to eat, and at least you can make a turkey and make her turkey soup and whatever else you want out of it. That, that'll last you a couple days. Yeah. I don't know. I think, um, I don't know what to think about it. I think it's a big fucking mess. And I just don't want to run out of toilet paper. Nope. I'd have to use all Donna's t-shirts during the second wave of COVID. No. <laughs> <laughs> you guys ever wipe your arse with a t-shirt? Because <laughs> we might have to. If you don't stock up on your toilet paper, or maybe your curtains. <laughs> We're gonna use your curtains, Donna, as toilet paper. You know paper. what I heard though? The first time that it happened, when toilet paper, you could not get <coughs> any. What? That people were, the, was it here? Or was it somewhere else? Or maybe they're talking about it here. Like people had, were resorting to fucking wiping their ass with their socks. Socks? Yeah. <coughs> yeah, there was I like, hope they weren't putting them back on. No, flush them. Flushing socks. Yeah, because some of the the I don't think it was here somewhere else that their their pipes and everything backed up because dirty cock suckers. Were they? wiping their ass because there was no toilet paper. Still, I would have fucking just. I don't know. I wouldn't a sock. <laughs> like I don't know, and just to flush it, I guess. Hope you have lots of socks. <laughs> and that's and that's Friday. So far, it's only morning. I know. There's so much like we have to do outside. Where we're gonna wait for the long weekends, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. We're gonna review something later. Donna was supposed to bring it down here before we started the video, but she didn't decide what we were gonna review. I said, Donna. Pick something you want to review later on so we can make a second video today and bring it down so we can uh, show the people. I'm going to be okay. Oh. I need you to... For fuck's sake, stop. You have your stool pushed... Oh, my God. Because I don't want my stool pushed in, eh? Holy fuck. Holy fuck nothing. Your back's all, like, pushed out like that. It's like you're flexing. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, yeah, we decided to do an early video today for you guys, because today's Friday, and usually when we do a video, like a supper video around that time, you guys are usually out doing your own Friday thing, and we don't get many, fuck, eh, uh, we don't get very many views on Fridays, so... We're going to release something early and maybe we'll get some views because it's out early, eh? Maybe. I don't know. Probably not. Friday's the worst for releasing videos. Maybe not for everybody. For 
but for our channel it is. It's the worst day. Nobody really watches on Fridays. Fridays and Saturdays. Yeah. yeah I know you guys get caught up later on, but on Friday and Saturday just the views are so low, it's like, you know. Yeah, it's... Death Bubba. Yeah, they have I get up and bring it closer, but it just says death, Bubba. It says 19% THC. If you want to watch us review this cocksucker right here, check out the next video. Eh? It'll be later on today. Yeah. No, there's... Yeah, we got... The day's long. We got shit to do, like... I got a, I got a couple old videos I got to retag for you guys so they pop up. I got videos that I... We got a 12, or not 12,000. Fuck! Eh? 1200. Yeah, we got 1,200 videos, over 1,200 videos. And a lot of, a lot of them don't pop up in your, in your recommendations because my tagging and stuff was real bad back then. So, nobody watches them because they just, nobody sees them. Eh? Yeah, we, the whole tagging system. Yeah, it's it, shit. You gotta really know what you're doing. Yeah, so I gotta go back and, and fix up a bunch of other old videos so they'll pop up in your thing, your 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 recommendations, and you guys can check out some of my first stuff. Eh? It was real bad, but it might be funny to watch. Eh? I was drunk through most of the, Why well, I was high? I was high and drunk. Like, I smoked weed and drank beer in the videos, but that's all... Those early videos are is me high and drunk and some real bad talking to the camera skills. I wasn't good at talking to the camera back then. <laughs> no, you are. I'm okay now. But I was real bad before. <laughs> anyway, enough talk of old videos. That's what I'm doing later today. I'm fixing up some videos so you guys can watch some old ones. They'll pop up for you. She's got to deal with the prick. Yeah, I got to take everything off, like, our sheets and everything off the bed. Yeah, and then we got to carry the mattress down here because the cocksuckers won't come into the house because they are COVID rules. At least they didn't before. They just leave the mattress you know, outside the fucking door and then we got to carry it in. I'm just going to ask if, you know, if they're... Can you just slide it in, in the door? I don't even want you going upstairs with your boots on. Just put it in the door. I can't, I know it's their job, but I cannot stand fucking people that come in the house with their boots on or their shoes on. It's, what's a mattress gonna do to your feet? Really? It, Some people are sensitive, Donna. Oh fuck, well I'm <clears throat> sensitive too when I gotta keep mopping the floors and vacuuming. <laughs> 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 I should have smoked a joint so I'm not bitchy. You should have. <laughs> I've been smoking weeds all morning. Donna over here. I don't know. What do you have to do? Okay. I, Just wait for the prick? Yeah, earlier I had to do, uh, I had to get a couple things. Like, smoke. We and then go driving, that's wrong. That's just the fridge kicking on. If you heard that, or if you hear it, just fucking ignore it, eh? Clock suckers. Um, fuck, I was gonna say something, you start talking about the fridge. Uh, maybe <laughs> it wasn't important. Probably wasn't. Fuck, I don't remember. It's gone. Fell out her ear. Okay. I thought you were going to fart. <laughs> no, Donna. Because you're like, you leave for it. I thought you were like, burnt. 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 Like, burnt. <laughs> Who the fuck makes that kind of fart sound? You do sometimes. No. It's like, this. It's like all tight. <laughs> <laughs>
Where were you going with that, Donna? <laughs> it was all tight. <laughs> yeah, tight farts. Tight farts? <laughs> I, mean, I guess it's better than loose ones. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was like, every time. I'd be wondering. <laughs> 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 okay. <coughs> I'm gonna <laughs> clean up my bowl. <laughs> like I think, um, just briefly about that. I think though, if you have, you know, people that have like loose farts. You're still on that. Yeah. This is. <laughs> I think it's because they have uh, bigger bowel movements, like bigger shits. I think they have like fat shits. <coughs> okay. <laughs> and this is breakfast with Donna. Breakfast is over. We're done. My breakfast is coming back up. It is not. Just gonna <coughs> talk about people that have fat shit. Yeah, I don't want to hear that. Um, did you know this is an indica? No. It is. It's an indica. I, it's I, an indica. I looked it up while you were talking earlier. Donna looked it up while I was talking earlier. Why well, didn't put you to bed? Put me to bed, yeah. <laughs> Donna, Why? this nine pound hammer right here is an indica. Well, maybe this is stronger. <laughs> maybe. We'll see. Uh. I don't really know what else to talk about. I can't bring the dog for a walk because all the bears are out during the day now. Bears are out during the day now. And I think they would grab one would grab Charlie. One of them might grab Charlie. And then what? Then... Fuck that. I, w I think I'd have to... I guess I wouldn't have to buy no more dog food. No! <laughs> I, I would have to run with Charlie, I think. I think the bear would catch you, Donna. Um... If you wanted to. We'd make herself into a ball. <laughs> she would serve herself to the bear. Yeah, it's supposed to do... But I thought you had to make yourself into a ball with something. That's what I heard, but would you really? <laughs> Probably not. I think I'd run like fuck. And if the bear caught up to me, well, I think I would kick, punch, and run still, but he might tackle me down. I think he looks like he, he looks like he's a swatter. Like he just come up to you <laughs> and just like that. Yeah, he probably slapped the shit out of me, but I don't think I could just lay there, though. I would hope that I was around houses and uh, nobody had their doors locked so I could just run in. I would run into somebody's house if a bear was chasing me. <laughs> She'd probably run through the fucking door. No. <laughs> locked or not, just bang right through the door. <laughs> I would take if somebody wanted to charge me for going into their house, whatever. It's better than getting eaten by a bear. <laughs> Donald ready to pull a B and E to get away from the. I think anybody bear. fucking would. I would. I wouldn't care if somebody had to run into the house if the fucking bear was chasing them. <laughs> you just gotta make sure you're at the right house. You know, some people are ready with their guns now because all the breaking enters. Yeah, if you have guns around here. Got the, yeah. There's lots of. <laughs> they're they're tired of people stealing their shit. Time for a little street justice, eh? <laughs> You have nothing else? No. Yeah, so I guess that's pretty much all we have this morning. Um, I don't know what else is going to happen today. If anything big happens, I'll film it for you guys, but nothing ever big happens around here. Okay. Uh, we're definitely going to do a review video for you guys later of yeah. uh, Death Bubba from Kootenai Botanicals. You just have to wait till we make it and upload it. It won't be for... Uh, Fuck! Hey! Uh, it won't be for a while, because... 
Donna has stuff to do, right? Yeah. And so do you. Well, I, sort of. I'm still gonna smoke my weeds with what I have to do. What I have to do doesn't require me not smoking weeds. All I gotta do is bang Donna and <laughs> tag some old <laughs> videos properly for you guys and smoke some more weeds and stuff. Go we'll scrub the old meat cigarette, you know. Just your regular day stuff. It's all. It's a boring day for me. Thank fuck for the weeds, eh? <laughs> Fucking right. Okay. Um. I'm gonna. Do uh, you got anything else to talk about? Um. No. Okay. I'm going to get in my road toe, eh? I see we got some new subscribers. Cigarette holder to you is. <coughs> Old subscribers. People watching that aren't subscribed. Hit your subscribe button and stick around. Or hit your subscribe button. Hit that. Button. Yeah. Hit our. Fuck! Eh? What is it? Hit the subscribe. Sub subscribe. Blah, blah. Yeah. Hit the subscribe button and stick around. We upload something every day, sometimes a couple things. We never leave you hanging like a cock. So, boop, push the button. I'm going to get in my road toke. Final words, Donna? Um, stay happy and stay safe. Uh, don't forget your masks. Be kind. If you live somewhere where there's lots of bears, then watch out for bears. Uh, enjoy your... Friday, and that's it. Come back later when you, if you're subscribed, you'll get a notification when the next video gets uploaded later. Another reason why you should hit that button. Right? Yeah. Whatever Donna just said, I wasn't listening. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> I was thinking to myself, I wonder if that joint's going to be any good. <laughs> it probably will be, but... I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we ever had Death Bubba before. I don't... Maybe from somewhere... I don't know. Yeah, take a quick look. Donna's going to do a quick search. I don't think we had it from Kootenai Botanicals. I don't think so. That's why we're reviewing it. <laughs> hey, look! Death Bub was my cock! Where's this from? No, not uh, there. What's this one? Sausage. What's that? No, th we've never had it. That one was dipped in, remember, in that dipped in sauce in Keith? But that's not from Kootenai and the other one. Death from Bubba dipped in sauce and keef. But like we this, had that from Can Abismo. But this is like your. Uh, oh, I did a Death Bubba review. Yeah, that's one of the ones I have to fix up. The, it's, the. Yeah, <laughs> see, like it's, it's real bad. Like I don't know if the review's bad. I don't remember doing the video, but the. Um, Tags? The tags are bad, so that's why you guys probably never seen it. It's probably never popped up for you guys. Yeah, we haven't done it from. Uh... So I've smoked Death Bubba before, just not from Kootenai. So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think that's all we have. That's all we got. You have anything else, Donna? Um, nope. Okay. We're going to fuck off out of here. Smoke some more weeds. Look for something else to munch on. Smoke some more weeds. Tag some old videos. Retag some old videos. Okay. Smoke some more weeds. 
watch some YouTube videos, and um, keep on smoking weeds. <laughs> so until later, like, subscribe, and fuck off. Hey! Ew, fuck, that's gross.